Hey guys, this is Clint Gage from Cinefix at Slamdance, and I'm sitting down with Steve Yu, the director of The Resurrection of Jake the Snake Roberts. Hey! First of all, just tell us a little bit about the project. Yeah, you know, well, it kind of started, I've been friends with Diamond Dallas Page, a professional wrestler, for probably 10 years. He just kind of brought up one day that, you know, his old friend, Jake the Snake Roberts, you know, was really down and out, like out of shape, and he wanted to help him try to turn his life around. And he said, I'm going to send him my fitness program. So, Because Dallas has a fitness company, and he wanted Jake to do his fitness program. And I, you know, being a filmmaker, I was like, well, this could be a really kind of interesting opportunity to film this crazy journey to try to help Jake. So I thought, well, what if we flew him to Atlanta to live with Dallas? That's my suggestion. And Dallas was like... Yeah, I don't know if that's a good idea because, <laughs> you know, Jake actually lived with Dallas a long time ago when they were kind of coming up. Dallas, when J Dallas was kind of coming up through the wrestling industry and uh, Jake lost a cobra in, in Dallas's house. So he was like, yeah, I don't he know. Mi literally that. misplaced yeah. a poisonous snake. Yeah. In yeah. Lost it in Dallas the bathroom. Himself. So. So, you know, it, it was kind of like this. This is a journey that, you know, we went in thinking that we we're going to help Jake kind of come back to, to good health. And we ended up learning that it was like there was so much about addiction like he was struggling with all these different addictions that we all of a sudden had to deal with now in terms of the wrestling aspect of it it's it's not really a documentary about wrestling at all so much as it is a documentary about helping uh helping this guy recover right. but um in, in terms of how, how much of a mindset did you have in terms of because wrestling is such a sort of re weird theatrical kind of event right how much of it was about sort of pulling back the curtain on that and seeing what it is uh, you know what it really does to to these athletes. Yeah, you know we didn't we didn't want to villainize the industry of wrestling. You know we wanted to kind of you know celebrate how great Jake really was. Like because we we didn't want this to be just for wrestling fans. We wanted it to be for almost anybody because the story is so universal. It's like anybody could have had the same situation in their life. It just happened to be like this larger than life you know wrestling legend so we wanted to celebrate jake and sh show people this is how awesome jake was when he was a wrestler and then say okay this is jake as a real person like he's like any of us who needs love and he needs support and you know it really i hope that it really kind of extends past like wrestling fans and and anybody can watch it and be inspired by it right right um so in terms of of uh being here we're here at slam dance uh and the film is showing here uh how's your experience been with uh with an independent festival like this yeah it's unbelievable i mean we've never none of us none of the filmmakers involved jake dallas or scott have ever you know been in this environment so it's just so cool to be recognized for this you know we've had this journey together for the last two and a half years worked on this film and we didn't even know if it was we we're gonna finish it many times because there was like you'll see when you see the film it's like so like you you think everything's going great and then it's like everything falls apart and we're like oh we're not gonna finish this film so so many times that happened so to be able to be here like our first screening was a s sold out and like when everybody came down after the film, like all of our guys, all the wrestlers came down, like everybody was like in tears and we're just hugging each other. It was crazy emotional because we couldn't believe it. Like we made it, not just we made the film, but like the guys made it here. Right. So it was really awesome. Yeah. Well, Steve, thanks for, for stopping by. Appreciate you talking to us. And everybody go find the resurrection of Jake the Snake Roberts. Um, it's it's a fascinating story. It really is if you're a wrestling fan or not. Uh, and stick around. Make sure to click like and subscribe for more Cinefix stuff from Slam Dance and from Sundance. Uh, and thanks for watching.